Hello and welcome. Uh, this is a video about the Fable Spin robot and how to get started with it. So this is the Fable Spin. It has a A and a B motor, and it has some sensors here. So uh, it it can detect colors and uh, light and uh, obstacle in front of it, so proximity. And uh, there's also infrared. Uh, so there's three sensors here that each can detect that. And also you can turn on the light. It's easier for the robot to see the color. Okay, so uh, the first thing we should do is to uh, is to build the, the robot with some wheels. So I'll put click on the wheels here. And also it needs a caster wheel. So I'll put that. So it's easier for the robot to move around. And then I I turn it on by pushing here. So then it lights up in a color. And uh, I take the hop uh, and put that into the USB in the computer. And it also lights up in a color. So uh, you see it has the same color. And if it's not in the same color, you can push here on the, on the hop. Or you can push the robot until it has the same color. So now they are both green. So now we're ready to begin programming. So the first thing we do is to uh, to see if uh, the computer has found the hub. You can see here it says hub and it's called set KD. Each uh, hub has its own uh, name. So uh, yours is called some something else. And we can see here that it has found one module. And if I click the little e Y here, I can see uh, that it's have it has found a, a spin module that is called X8G and it has 60% of power and the connection is good. So I can turn off that again. So the first thing we should do is to go into actions and scroll down to the, the spin modules. I find this move forward block and I take it out here. And here I can uh, switch between move forward backwards, stop moving, or move left or right. So if I just want to get it to move forward, uh, I can just push push play here, and it will, it will go for around two seconds uh, forward. Uh, but remember that now we have a robot on wheels, so uh, either I should uh, hold it in my hands or put it down on the floor so it doesn't fall off. So if I want to have spin move for more than two seconds. I should add a uh, weight in uh, after the, the move block here. And that is found here under loops. Wait in seconds. Click here. And I can write, for example, three seconds. It will go for the two seconds and then three more seconds. 